most exciting things we can expect from Tesla in 2019. Hey everyone, it's Alexa again and welcome back to another video. This year is going to be a critical one for Tesla and today we're going to have a look at what we can expect from this company that was formed in 2003. We feature some past achievements, little known facts, and what 2019 has in store. It's a numbers thing. It's believed that by the time 2019 comes to an end, Tesla would have sold around half a million vehicles. Elon Musk has also promised to open a dealership in South Africa, the country where he was born. There are two red flags for the company this year. One being the economic slowdown in the US, and the second is the first stage of the 2020 national election in America. There is some good news, and we'll investigate that later on. January done and dusted. 2019 started with Tesla reporting on their fourth quarter and full year vehicle delivery numbers. The Model 3 is expected to add exponentially to their 2019 total. Supersize me. Tesla has managed to build the largest touchscreen and interface panel, which measures 17 inches. The dashboard speedometer has also been made into a digital screen. Crunch the numbers. February came and went, and Tesla reported a profitable third quarter in 2018, and it's possible that they could possibly post their first six-month period in the black. Their top-line revenue is expected to surge, and that 2019 could see the company bringing in close to $30 billion. World first. Tesla holds the honor of having the first electric car to have received the Motor Trend Car of the Year award, and that accolade went to the Tesla Model S. Driving force. Electric vehicles have reached a milestone in Norway, and in 2018, one-third of new cars sold in Norway were operated by battery. Sadly, Tesla was not in the lead here. That spot was taken by the Nissan Leaf, and the Tesla Model S came in second. It's predicted that the sale of electric vehicles in Norway will wane in 2019, but quadruple in North America. Fill her up. As much as we like our mobile phones to charge quickly, it's not quite the service you'd expect from your car. But that's about to change. Tesla V3 Supercharging promises that with five-minute charges, you'll get a range of 75 miles. There are currently 12,000 supercharging stations around the globe, and charging times are going to reduce by 15 minutes. April update. April 2019 will be a good time to see how things are going with the new Tesla factory in Shanghai. Building began in 2018, but Tesla will need to take a loan of a few billion to finish the project. This factory will produce vehicles for the Chinese market and is predicted to be a massive success. January. The Guardian published an article in January stating that Tesla would be cutting 3,000 plus jobs as cars are still too expensive. Musk says he has no choice but to cut the headcount at Tesla. It accounts for 7% of the workforce. Musk was quoted as saying, the road ahead is very difficult and that they were up against a big incumbent industry. In October 2018, 45,000 people were employed by Tesla. In the pipeline, Tesla has long-term plans to build minibuses and semi-trucks in the future. Musk has said the following about the pickup truck, a really futuristic, like, cyberpunk Blade Runner pickup truck made with a lot of titanium. May be some good news. In May, Tesla will have a good idea of whether they will have enough cash to get through 2019 or if they'll have to raise more capital. Some reports suggest that Tesla keeps less money in the bank than they need to run the company for a year. But if it can sustain profitability this year, then they won't have a need to raise any additional capital. Time is of the essence. Did you know that Tesla stations will swap out a Tesla battery for under $60? And if you have a Model S, a new one is fitted within 90 seconds. June bug. June predictions for Tesla believe that it will be a bumper season for Tesla. Model 3 production levels will increase and units with less expensive trims will be available. A weighty issue. Did you know that the Model X weighs so little that it's not technically legal to drive it over the Brooklyn Bridge? The big news. People have been waiting with bated breath for the release of the new Tesla Model Y. Musk has announced that the vehicle will be launched on the 14th of March 2019 at the LA Design Studio. This is the company's first compact SUV. Production will only commence in 2020. It's believed that this vehicle will take a few minutes to charge. Musk tweeted some additional details about the vehicle, saying it would be 10% bigger than the Model 3 and will cost proportionally more. Face the facts. Not too much more is known about the new Model Y, but here are a few questions answered. What is it? A compact SUV. What's its mile range? No one knows. Can you reserve one? Not at the moment, but you can be able to purchase one in 2020. What'll it cost? Well, we'll just have to see. 
If you could own a Tesla vehicle, which one would you purchase and why? Let us know in the comments below. New home. It's wonderful to have such amazing predictions for Tesla, and if all goes according to plan and they make as many vehicles as they hope to, they could be faced with a major problem nearer the end of 2019. The aging factory in Fremont, California will not cope with the additional workload and could potentially fall apart. However, that's a problem that can easily be fixed and would be the focus of 2020.